Hey everybody, Michelle Lang here and I'm with Dina Wolf. Hi. And we are here to talk to you guys about cleansing. Reason being is one of our favorite things to do is to cleanse. Um, so have you thought about cleansing this year so far in 2018? Maybe let go of some of all of that junk? Well, we're here to talk to you a little bit today about some of the things that you can do and how to get started and what to look for to see if you even need to do a cleanse. Yeah, now before I cleansed, just this year. Um, I've cleansed in the past, but it had been a while since I've done a cleanse, so I knew like I had some stuff to clear out. So before I actually cleanse and restore this time, I felt like I was aging as a, at a, like a really accelerated yeah. rate. Mm -hmm. I was starting to get cystic acne on my face. My pores were getting really big and I saw more wrinkles on my face popping up. And of course, Nobody likes to see that. And I just felt like I was aging faster than average. My sleep patterns were getting like really wonky along with my menstrual cycles as well. That was, uh, I was just really like struggling to lose weight. And I just felt like no matter what I did, I just couldn't budge that stinking scale. So after the cleanse, I noticed that I have much clearer skin. My wrinkles have gotten far less. My pores are shrinking. They're almost like not even noticeable. Uh, I've gotten several compliments mm -hmm. on my skin in the yes. last uh, couple of weeks. Yes. I'm so excited. And my cycles are completely regular now and my sleep is solid. My favorite part, I lost six and a half pounds in the first 15 days of my cleanse. And I'm like, woohoo, celebrate that win, That's amazing. Right? Yeah. That's a real accomplishment yeah. to take to the to take to the bank yeah you know, just flush that six and a half pounds oh, right flushed. down the toilet and then there you go <laughs> <laughs> i love it so um, tell me about you like what did you notice with your cleanse so i cleanse every once in a while especially when i start to feel really icky mm -hmm. so and what i mean by icky is like i notice that um uh, i don't really go i'm not really regular i'll end up with gassy mm -hmm. and bloatiness even though i eat a pretty clean diet and i'm doing the right things i'm exposed to a lot of stuff um mm -hmm. environmentally that i don't have control mm -hmm. over i think we all yeah. are yeah, and yeah. Um, the air we breathe. Yeah, and so Everybody needs to breathe. I notice, you know, I'll notice that I I'm not absorbing my my, my vitamins and minerals as well because because my my nails will split sometimes. Gotcha. And, mm -hmm. and uh, my skin gets super dry and it doesn't seem to hold the you know moisture real well. Mm -hmm. And um, but the biggest I think is the fact that I'll get like night sweats. <gasps> oh, oh, so hormone imbalance. Yes, and, and there's mm -hmm. really nothing worse than waking up. In the middle of the night, in the middle of winter, freezing cold from a from a cold oh, sweat. No thanks. Because you're just backed up. Not backed up as in you haven't gone in the restroom, but your your whole full system is just full of toxins and it can't function right. Yeah. So um, I decided this last time I was having some. I noticed that I was having some achiness over the all over the body and. Uh, I wasn't really fighting off the regular colds like I normally do as well. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And um, that's right, your immune system was getting a little, a little wonky, compromised. Huh? And yeah. I was, uh, honestly, I had serious fatigue. I was tired. I couldn't catch up on my sleep. I was exhausted, tossing and turning. So you know, I just decided, okay, that's it. I got to redo it. Another cleanse. It's time mm -hmm. for a cleanse. And so I started the cleanse this last time, and within the first week, my energy and digestion improved greatly. Um, that's amazing. I did cleanse out through the skin a little bit, but since then it's been great. My skin mm -hmm. looks amazing. Mm -hmm. um, I feel better. My bathroom stops are much, much more pleasant. <laughs> <laughs> You're not offending and making people run, huh? <laughs> right? right? Yeah. You're like, what did you yeah. eat? No. Mm -hmm. um, but it was uh, totally worth it. Uh, and I, I really, f I found that since I, I had such good results with this last cleanse, I'll probably do another 30 days yeah, just to too. keep it going. Me too. Um, like more wrinkles can go. Yeah. yeah. I, I think I, I cleared a lot out, but I felt <laughs> mm -hmm. like maybe I need to do more. But Because mm -hmm. normally I can do just one mm -hmm. and it'll it'll keep my system going for a few months. Yeah. You know? But um, yeah, it's kind of some of the stuff I was going through. Yeah. So I, I've noticed with the clients that we've dealt with in the past, mm -hmm. um, starting with a cleanse for really no matter what it is that you're trying to deal with has been a really huge motivator and facilitator of getting to the health goal that most people are seeking out. So if you want to feel better and you're stuck in a body that has like a lot of an autoimmune disorder, mm -hmm. stuck with weight, like we're yes. talking about, if you have skin issues at all, 
uh, any of the ones that I talked about or any others, this is such a great place to start. And if you have a health issue that you're like, hey, would this help me? Just mm -hmm. type it below and ask the question. We'd love to help you. And think that this is, and believe and know because we've seen it over and over again, the results people get by doing this first before mm -hmm. they move on to a different type of um, wellness program or you know whatever Starting it is anything anything um, I've worked Any with regimen I've worked with several clients like one of the one of the best ones I've worked with so far that I'm still working with and she's done amazing with her results and it just touches my heart um, to be able to help people see what they're capable of doing yeah, and that they yeah. can feel better and her name was Renette and Renette came to me um, a little while back probably a few months ago mm -hmm. Um, she was feeling really um, uncomfortable. She had just been diagnosed with fibromyalgia. Mm -hmm. uh, she had about a lot of weight gain over several years and she was tired and exhausted and had anxiety and stressed out and they wanted to put her on a bunch of medication and, and the medication wasn't going to necessarily help with what mm -hmm. she was going through and mm -hmm. she, she just came because she's like, I just don't know what's wrong. Yeah. I just need help. Mm -hmm. and. Um, so we started our first thing on a cleanse mm -hmm. right away. Mm -hmm. uh, that's always usually my go-to with somebody with any kind of autoimmune issue. Oh, absolutely. Um, yeah. Because you have to flush the body of whatever is the body's holding on it's to. It's bombarded with, yeah, it's just like I can't tolerate one more thing. Yeah. It's like the trash can that mm -hmm. gets full. You can't overstuff it. Yeah. It just doesn't let you, right? Yeah. <laughs> you know? Nobody's taking out the trash. It just gets stinkier and stinkier. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. um, and the and the cleanse is more than just what you're probably thinking, like a digestive cleanse. We, we this is the full body. This is mm -hmm. your. We're gonna cleanse everything. We're cleansing in your lungs, yeah. your blood, your liver, your mm -hmm. digestive system. You're Lymph, cleansing. Yeah. Everything. Kidneys, mm -hmm. Yeah, and mm -hmm. anything gets stored up and it's mm -hmm. going. But anyway, back on track. She she worked really hard within the first 15 days. She lost. Um, close to five to ten pounds of just inflammation and weight alone. She changed her diet and applied the cleanse. She mm -hmm. had a very clean diet on the cleanse, which mm -hmm. we, we always suggest. Mm -hmm. um, and then now, total weight loss in probably about six months, she's she's been able to, with a healthy eating lifestyle and mm -hmm. making several changes in her in her um, her diet and applying the cleansing. Um, techniques that you've given tools her and mm -hmm. everything I've given her she's mm -hmm. now dropped down to a full 39 pounds and her goal was 35 that is awesome and she feels great oh she my now goodness. no longer has any more pain from fibromyalgia Dang. um she hasn't had any anxiety issues she's uh, feeling amazing like she's just in tears at how happy she feels wow. But I think my so impressive. favorite part about all of it was her sister is the one that had brought her in and asked me to help her. Mm -hmm. And um, that's what I love to do. I just love you know, helping people. I love helping people. Me too. And two weeks later, she came in crying to me and she said, I just want to tell you thank you for Aww. giving me my sister back. Aww. And it was really a lot easier so than awesome. you can think mm -hmm. to do. Mm -hmm. Simple. Yeah, so simple. Some, something so simple, just cleansing the body, flushing it out, drinking more water, eating better, and taking a few, a handful of supplements that really work hard to facilitate those efforts that you're making already. Easy, mm -hmm. huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, it's been so easy. We do it as a group to help remind you, to keep you on track and accountable, because I know me, I tend to fall, you know, I get distracted and on something else, you mm -hmm. know, and go, oops, I forgot to to do my cleanse, da, 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 you know, so we do work really hard to keep us all accountable, which is awesome and, mm -hmm. and work together as a team to facilitate your efforts as well. Right. So I did want to share too, um, our friend, uh, Monica, who had oh, horrible fibromyalgia and autoimmune, a bunch of autoimmune disorders, um, heart disease. She was basically bedridden. Her husband, she was so crippled from the pain. We'd have, her husband would have to pick her up and take her to the bathroom when she was done, bring her back and put her back into bed. And she was anxious because, she was anxious and depressed at the time as well because she had little kids at home and felt like she wasn't being the wife, the mom that she wanted to be. She wasn't, yeah. she wasn't happy in her role in the home because of her pain and her illness. It was keeping her from that role that she loved so much. Yeah. And it uh, breaks my heart because uh, her husband was like, you know, we've tried everything, can you please 
you know, do what you do and see if you can help her. I'm like, yeah, yeah, let's give it a try. It was to the point where he had to carry her when she was in a lot of pain. He'd have mm -hmm. to carry her everywhere, everywhere from the couch to the bed or um, she would be down and mm -hmm. out for mm -hmm. several days. And, and I think there's nothing more debilitating to a husband to not mm -hmm. be able to help his wife yeah, you in feel, pain. You feel and, helpless. You know, mm -hmm. and as a, as a wife, you know, to feel as if you're not meeting your role. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. it's awful. So within the first two weeks of the cleanse, she was up moving around. By the, the 30 days, she was at the gym. And now this woman won, runs Spartan races. Mm -hmm. This is a woman who suffered from fibromyalgia and horrific autoimmune disorder for years. Migraines. Migraines. Had um, a heart, a, a stent placed at the age of 35. So she had heart disease on top of it. And she, she was fit. She wasn't overweight, obese, or anything like that. She looked healthy from the outside, but on the inside wasn't. And so um, we're so proud of her because she has mm -hmm. come so far. She has made huge strides in her health. She took it by the reins and said, I, I'm not gonna live that life anymore. I wanna be the mom that I wanna be. Mm -hmm. I wanna be the wife that I wanna be. And I want to be a part of this family, an active part of this family. And now she is, bless her heart, and she is doing phenomenal and helping other people do the same. So. Mm -hmm been great and uh, another one is uh, Ginger uh, she was suffering from rheumatoid arthritis high cholesterol high blood pressure hypothyroid plantar fasciitis she was pre-diabetic she had allergies so bad mm -hmm. that the allergy shots that she was getting would give her anaphylaxis so that was no longer an option for her she her toxicity level had reached like an all-time high it was like no more can come in yeah you know I cannot take one more thing yeah get it out you know so we went ahead and did the cleanse for her within one week the rheumatoid arthritis symptoms had gone away she no longer had the pain and the, the achy joints mm -hmm. She quit having the allergies within oh. that week as well. Mm -hmm. um, she hasn't had them since. It's been about eight years almost. And um, she doesn't have any of the other things either. So right. no more thyroid issue, blood pressure, all that's all resolved, which is phenomenal. And the, she's, she's 60, she'll be 66 next month. Mm -hmm. And her doctor told her she is healthier than a 20 year old. That's how phenomenal she's doing. She's dropped 67 pounds and is living her best life. And I have to tell you, she's an inspiration. She's mm -hmm. beautiful. Mm -hmm. She's a gorgeous, gorgeous woman. Mm -hmm. She's lost. I could not have imagined her having 67 right? pounds more on mm -hmm. her mm -hmm. or being so debilitated. She's a tiny she's little frame, too. So yeah. independent. Mm -hmm. I mean, this woman has a completely... Different life, huh? Different life. Mm -hmm. She has her own organic garden in the back. She's mm -hmm. out there it, touching the soil, feeding herself well, mm -hmm. you know, doing what she needs to do to keep Loving her body cleaned it. out, to, to not deal with the effects of mm -hmm. everything around us. You know, mm -hmm. there's so many environmental effects. We have plastics and toxins in the air. Yeah. And, and as, as, as well as you may be doing, you can't get it all. No. So you have to do what you can to flush it out. Yeah, absolutely. So. Absolutely. Now, we um, are going to be doing a cleanse at the beginning of the month. So if you would like to cleanse with us at the beginning of the month and are sick and tired of being sick and tired, no matter what it is that you're dealing with health-wise, we want to help you. So we have some limited positions left in our program for our next cleanse to do a cleanse and restore. Okay, so right. we're going to flush everything out and then we're going to replenish our bodies right. with good healthy which is very important um, bacteria which is huge like Michelle said hugely important and um, if you're it's only if you're serious if you're someone who starts something and doesn't finish this is not for you we want um, people who are serious about getting healthy for this amazing program and we have a very few seats left so I would love to hear from you mm -hmm. um, we do have an interview process that we do and if you'd like to Feel, if you want to feel a little better or a lot better, let us know. You're going to click the link below. Yep. One of our team members will reach out to you and see if you qualify for the program. Right. If you'd like to join us. So right. we're mm -hmm. excited to help. Mm -hmm. um, we only want to see you succeed. Yeah, so. absolutely. So we look forward to hearing from you. You have a wonderful, blessed day. Bye.